The city of Manama, capital of the Kingdom of Bahrain, was the setting for the Bahrain 24-hour supercar challenge. Tournament organisers were relieved as the heavy overnight rain which had waterlogged the circuit at the Seif shopping mall drained quickly thanks to the use of a revolutionary aqua vacuum system and the race started on time. The leading competitors made their way onto the grid at the start line before the flag was lifted to signal the start of the 23 teams endurance race. The early leader was the Gulf Formula One team who earlier had taken pole position. This was no surprise but disaster was soon to strike. The Formula One outfit was forced to make a pit stop after being penalised by a series of black flags for reckless driving and they eventually lost over seven minutes to the leaders. The race officials explained to the disappointed Gulf Formula One team why they had been penalised, while the Penelope Pit Stops, the only all-girl racing team, made a rapid changeover of drivers in pit lane as they chased the leaders. As day became night, the Unstoppables One team maintained their lead through careful concentration. Leading the chase in the floodlit arena were the Penelope Pit Stops, Unstoppables 2, Rev Zone Racing and Golf Formula 1. Numerous bleary-eyed spectators watched the action from corporate boxes as the cameraman recorded the action on track. It was last throw of the dice for the Golf Formula 1 team as they made a frenetic last changeover in a bid to reclaim the lead in the closing stages. However, the early penalty for reckless driving cost them dear as the Unstoppables 1 team waved at the crowd as they cruised around the final lap. Their pit crew waved flags in celebration as an official produced the chequered flag to signal the Unstoppables were the Bahrain 24-hour supercar challenge champions. They had completed a total of 1,000 144 laps.